happy sad today happy sabbath everyone it's your girl mimi hitting you up this morning with a video from the usual spot look at the bird in the back again go and support my movement at www.milasinspiration.com or hit me up with a call so i can send it anywhere to you in the world i thank you and appreciate your support i thank you for every view every thumbs up that you um you have left on my post um god bless you i pray that everything you touch will become golden um somebody asked me a very important question yesterday how is it that you balance your life your job your business um and uh, managed to do inspirational videos. I'm inspired every day based on the jobs that I do. I'm inspired every day based on the efforts that I put into ensuring that I still look this fresh when I come on to a video. Fresh to death, they would say. It was my favorite word, fresh to death. Um, I am in the process of ensuring that everything that I prayed for, every seed that I have sown, it become fruition. I thank God for blessing me with the knowledge and the understanding to acknowledge when I am failing at something and when something does not support me or I need to put more effort into getting what I need to get done. While they sleep, I hustle. I tell people all the time, I don't do mere work. I hustle. I'm a hustler. And when you're a hustler, then you will touch different things to make sure that you have something that is continuous. You may make sure that you have something that will fulfill your heart's desire. Um, you wake up, you get up every day, you're unhappy, you complain about the things that you have or that you don't have when you should just simply give thanks. I thank God for my problems because he will provide me with a solution. I thank God for my job. I thank God for my family, even though they get on my nerves. I thank God for the, the few little genuine people that I meet on a day-to-day -day basis that are in my life, my support system, which is God himself, who I cannot thank enough. And the few little people I can count on this hand that I can say to myself, oh, that person will look out for me one day we're going to die that's the that's the most common thing we have um in with each other the most commonality that we have is that we are all going to die yeah scary much huh we are all going to die and i don't fear death what i fear is existing and never lived because most time we're on this earth we're just simply existing and not living we just simply exist because we're not happy or we live our life to please other people and that's the thing i did for years pleasing other people and not pleasing myself now i submit myself under the hands of the almighty and i please him and once god is all right with what i'm doing and once i am all right with what i'm doing I don't give a flying piff because at the end of the day, you have to live with who you are. You have to live with the decisions that you make. You have to acknowledge where you're going wrong and right the wrong that you did. None of us is perfect. We cannot point fingers at each other because guess what? We all fall short. We all sin and fall short of the glory of God. Let the church say amen. Touch your neighbor and say neighbor. Yeah. Me, myself, and I, we have all fall short of the glory of God. Yes, we have all sinned. We've all sinned. We have all sinned. We have all done some messed up things that we regret that we did and stuff. But most of us, the time we sit down trying to pick the beam from other people's eyes, we need to focus on what we have done wrong, try to fix it, or leave it alone. God will fix it for you because some problems you get yourself in, honey, you can't fix it. You cannot fix that. Trust me, you can't fix it. But give God the glory and acknowledge where you have gone wrong. So this morning, I'm imploring you that never give up. 
Don't give up on yourself. Don't give up on other people that you 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 love. Don't give up on yourself. Don't give up on other people that you love. Forgive. Every day you get up, you forgive and ask for renewed strength. Forgive, ask for renewed strength, and God will renew you. It is God will. You know, not it's God will. It's not your will. Let God will be done in your life. Sorry about that, guys. I was crossing the street. Let God will be done in your life. Give God the glory. Acknowledge him first and foremost as our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Acknowledge him and he shall direct your path. Give God the glory, somebody. Shout a hallelujah. And make sure you know that when you are doing something, God is watching us from a distance. All right? So go on and, sell, go on and have yourself a blessed day. God bless you guys. I'll see you soon. I'll give you a more detailed uh, inspiration when I have the time. But today is a big day for me have a very huge project that I need to complete in the name of Jesus. Thank you, God. I thank God for you guys too. God bless you and I'll see you soon. Peace out. Again, get some rest, man, and stop minding people's business on social media. God bless you. Take care.